everyone, this is Aryan Rashid from Cadmaker Solutions and today I'm going to show you how to save a template and use it in your future part files, assembly files or drawing files. So for that, let's at first create one template. Let's say we're gonna have a part file and then um, as we know in a template you can customize your dimensions, your dimensioning standards and units. So that's exactly what we'll be doing here. Um, we'll go to system options, document properties, and then we'll make some changes with the, with the units, let's say, and then with the dimensions, we'll make few changes over here, and let's say that's all we need, we need for now, and we would want to use this template in the future profiles. So for that, we have to save this at first. Same way, we go to document properties, and then as you saw, as you see here, it's already labeled as and see modified so we would have to save these things to an external file uh, for me I will just save it here uh, and then I will save it and that's done now let's say I want to I want to work with a part file I want to create a new part file right and I don't want to always make those changes and create the template. All I have to do is go to document properties and then load. As, as you see here, it's only NC or ANSI over here under overall uh, drafting standard. And now we can just load the template from where we saved, export it, and press OK. And you can see that our document properties uh, here we have this drawing the one we just saved and then we can keep on working with this template that's all I had for now thank you for watching this, uh, this tech tip video see you all in the next one take care bye